safe day at St. Stephen's Green in Loretto in town. And we are doing a song school with some girls for the last two days, class 4B in transition year. So we've been doing four songs. So like we spent to four different groups and each group wrote and performed their own song. And they like made their own chords with, with all the instruments. It's really so they're cool. All, they're all great, great songs. And we love jamming out to them. Like we love it. So good. So yeah, so let's go meet the first group. Woo! Hi, so we're here with our first band. Uh, can you introduce yourselves, please? I'm Emer. I'm Eleanor. I'm Suniva. I'm Clara. <laughs> uh, what's the name of your band? Um, it's called It's Not a Phase, Ma'am. And why did you call it that? Um, we called it that because of the different experiences and phases we go through. Uh, growing up as teenagers and um, yeah. Uh, was it hard to think of the name? Um, n no, it came very easily to us. Okay, uh, what's the name of your song that you wrote? Um, our song is called Panic at the Disco. Uh, why? Um, well, we wrote it because it's about our experiences growing up as a teenager and losing people at a disco. Uh, did you enjoy writing the song? Uh, yes, we thoroughly enjoyed writing the song. Uh, we're going to listen to the song. Here with the next group. Would you like to introduce yourselves, please? Hi, I'm Michelle. Hi, I'm Helen. Hi, I'm Stephanie. Hi, I'm Quiva, and we're missing Amber and Cara. Great. Okay, what's your band's name? Uh, our band's called Metaphorically Speaking. Um, what's your song called? The Hourglass. Why is it called this? Um, because it's. The hourglass is a metaphor for like time ticking away and um, planning our future. Um, what's it about? Uh, the song's about growing up. What inspired you to write it? Um, we were kind of just thinking about like all the different things you have to go through like as you're growing up, so kind of moving on from school and kind of just making choices that you don't think you're ready to make yet. Um, how did you go about writing the lyrics and tune? Like who? Um, we all just sat down and thought of what what like we wanted to put in the song, and then we put the word like all the words together at the end. So yeah. And um, who created the band name? Like, what's the meaning behind it? 
Um, I made up the band name. Um, it was, well, our song uh, uses a metaphor of the hourglass, so I thought it was kind of um, cool that the band is called Metaphorically Speaking. Are you now considering writing more songs? Uh, I don't know, like, it was a really, really fun experience, so maybe, you never know. Um, okay, thank you. That's it. Now we're going to um, hear one of your songs. Your song. <laughs> Nearly there, it's almost time. Is it okay? That was great. Now for our next band, can you guys introduce yourselves? I'm Orla. I'm Eve. Hey, I'm Kira. I'm Ashling. I'm Rachel. I'm Eva. I'm Megan. And what's the name of your band? We're the Elk Whispers. So what's the name of the song that you've written today? It's called The Storm. And what's the inspiration behind your song? Um, we thought that we'd write a song about how when you were younger you used to be all like really happy and give a care about the world and then when you grow up it gets kind of hard but you still have to remember to have fun. Was the song difficult to write? It was pretty hard to write like some of the like getting the tuning right but the lyrics came pretty quickly to us because we all worked well as a team. Is the song based on real life events? Well, we all have to grow up, so yes, I guess. Some like some things relate to other people and some don't, but um, yeah, most of it's relatable. And what was your favourite bit in the song-making process? Um, I really liked working with the um, our band manager, <laughs> Ashling, <laughs> because she's like really talented in music. <laughs> okay, now we're going to hear the song. <laughs> Growing up feels 
got nothing to lose. So what's the, or would you like to introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Rachel. Clara. I'm Lisa. Uh, I'm Faye. And we're also missing two other girls, Anya and Lois. And what's the name of your band? Um, uh, the name of our band is Green Beans. <laughs> and what made you come, come up with this name? Um, well, we got the green from Loretto on the green, so I thought it was pretty fitting. And then we liked Green Beans, so we thought it went well. <laughs> what's your song called? It's called Freedom. And how did you come up with this name? Well, we thought in um, fourth year the one thing we got more of was freedom. So we wrote a song and then a lot of, well, it was kind of about freedom, so we thought we'd give it the title Freedom. And was it difficult to write? Yeah, we found it difficult to write, but uh, it came to us in the end. What was your favourite part about making the song? Um, that we all worked well together as a team. Thank you. Now we're going to hear the song. I got a job that doesn't exist. Yes, I do. It's too much trouble, so I'm going to resist. Yes, I will. So many people, they don't understand. No, they don't. It's hard keeping busy with time on my hands More freedom, more respect What you give is what you get More freedom, more respect What you give is what you get the Italy trip was really great Yes it was Except getting sick from the food that we ate Community care was a breath of fresh air B. Um, thanks for listening and we'll now pass you on to the next class. Thank you very much. Thanks guys. Hi guys, this is 4M and here's our first group. Hi, I'm Emma. Hi, I'm Neve. I'm Christina. Hi, I'm Kira. I'm Jenny. <laughs> What's the name of your song and band? The name of our song is 600 Watts. Um, what was your in inspiration to this song? 
I left my spoon in a bowl of soup and then I put it in the microwave and the microwave is now warm. Um, what was your favourite part of the two days? My favourite part of the two days was recording the song. Okay. Um, did you enjoy the two days? Uh, yeah, we really enjoyed the first few days and it was a really different experience and Joey and Kevin were really nice and helpful. <coughs> Do you think you'll start writing your own songs? Yeah, now that we've been shown how to put together our own songs and how to use the software, it's really encouraged us to write our own ones. And how does your song make you feel? It makes us feel sorry for all the spoons that have been put in the microwave. Okay, thank you. <laughs> let's see. Now let's hear the song. <laughs> our second group from 4M. Uh, hi, I'm Quillen. Hi, I'm Quillen. I'm Jessie. I'm Sarah. I'm a man. Uh, what was the name of your song? Dublin Bus. And what's the name of your band? The Leapers. And what was the uh, inspiration for your song? The difficulties we encounter every day on Dublin Bus. Uh, what was your favourite part of the two days? Um, recording the song. Did you enjoy the two days? Yeah. Do you think you'll start writing your own songs now? Um, maybe now that we have um, the knowledge that we need to write them. And lastly, how does your song make you feel? It makes us feel very angry about Dublin bus. All right, thanks guys. Now let's go to the next group and hear the song first.
group and if you could introduce yourselves. I'm Kira. Hi I'm Chloe. I'm Sarah. I'm Grace. I'm Kyron. And what's the name of your band? Um, we're the Top Toppers and the song is 6495. Uh, what was your inspiration for the song? Um, well we were just like doing brainstorms and then it just came up in the conversation so we did it. What was your favourite part of the two days? Um, I think our favourite part of the two days was hearing the song played at uh, when all the uh, music had been added and hearing it all come together. Um, did you enjoy the two days? Yeah, we did. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think you'll start working on your own songs now? Um, we really enjoyed it, so we might write some stuff in the future. How does your song make you feel? Um, the song kind of makes us feel quite depressed, as in, like, we don't have enough money to buy clothes. And <laughs> yeah. Okay, thank you. Let's hear the next song. Cashier broke my heart when I heard her say 
the price you pay. 6495 6495 6495 Okay, so now we have our next band. What are your names? Ellen, Ashling, Jervlop, Case, Katrina, Fiona. And what's the name of your band? The Six Legends. And what was the inspiration for your song? Um, we were brainstorming, we were looking at our news feeds and we were looking at all the stupid things that people were doing, so, yeah. And what's your favourite part of the two days? Uh, probably hearing what our song sounded like when it was all put together and stuff. And did you enjoy the two days? Yeah, we really enjoyed it. We'd never written a song before, so it was a really good new experience. So do you think you'll start writing your own songs? Um, yeah, definitely in the future. <laughs> We'd start writing our own songs. Oh, uh, so here's the song. <laughs> Stayed up all night, stressing all week. Trying to get my eyebrows on fleek Life for a name, stress of that I'd love a spice bag, I'm so fat Thanks for listening. We hope you liked our songs. Uh, we're 4M and we're going to hand you over to the next group. Hi, we're 4G from Loretto on the Green. We're going to meet our first group now. <laughs> Tell us what's your name. I'm Eva. <laughs> I'm Sophie. I'm Rachel. Lucy. Emily. And Judy. Right, guys, so uh, what's your band called? The, the uh, Dark Ones. The Dark Ones. <laughs> the Dark Side. <laughs> okay, The Dark Side. What is your song called, The Dark Side? My Best Friend. My Best Friend. My Best Friend. And what is your song about? Okay, our song yeah. is about someone who has an alcohol addiction and they're making it out that their best friend is a human, but they're actually a drink. Oh. that's very deep and why did you choose to write your song about this 
Um, because a few weeks ago we had a t- uh, talk from these women <laughs> from uh, Kimura. <laughs> Sorry, again, I'm really bad at Irish. And uh, they were really inspiring, and we thought we'd um, write a song about it because we were inspired. But Well, it's good that you have some inspiration from it. That was very good. And what have you learned from song school? How to edit and produce a song. Yeah, and how, to, that how easy it can be. Well... <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, Dark Side. Now we're going to hear their song. My best friend by the dark side, and now we're going to speak to our next group. What are your names, guys? Ruth. I'm Julie. Cleva. Lana. Eliza. And Tara. And also our friend Sarah, who was unfortunately unable to make it today. She's, she's playing hockey right now, but uh, shout out to Sarah Murray. And guys, what's your group name called? G Force, yeah. G Force, yeah. G Force, right? And that's kind of like your class name backwards, isn't it? Like four G G. Yeah. 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 yeah, cool, yeah. cool guys, yeah. cool. So, um, what's your song called? G Force. No, no, no. 
it's called is it banter yeah banter. yeah it's called yeah, banter banter, banter yeah. right your song banter and uh <laughs> what's your song banter about it's about a bit of banter that we've had in the class um and just some private jokes and um yeah kind of like what makes up our class like all ingredients that like form the recipe of banter <laughs> <laughs> a spoon of mischief <laughs> a spoon of mischief okay <laughs> So um, that sounds very interesting. I'm excited to hear it. So uh, tell us, what did you learn from song school? Um, we learned... We're very creative. We're creative. We're and top groovers. Top groovers would definitely be something I learned. Yeah. Um, how to write we, a song, how to edit a song. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, really really yeah express our thoughts. Yeah, express our in music form. <laughs> Hi, <laughs> 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 yeah, can you hand that over, please? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so we're going to hear G Force's song, Bante. <laughs> G, but, uh, sorry, that was Banter by the band G Force. Thank you guys. Now, next we have uh, probably our best group, my group. Yes. Um, we're called Absolute Wizards. <laughs> and we wrote a song called Spice Up Your Life. So, we're going to say all the names of our band members. I'm Clara. I'm Alex. I'm Rebecca. I'm Hannah. I'm Ella. I'm Ashley. <laughs> That is my team. Now, guys, I'm going to ask you the questions. What inspires you to write your song about spice bags? Uh, we wanted to bring passion to our song, and every group member had a strong, loving passion towards a traditional Asian meal. Uh, <laughs> are you okay? Um, we wanted to use this passion to empower the song. However, we, Im- 
we applied our lyrics to the music as a metaphor of the fulfillment and enjoyment of life. We must enjoy and savour every moment like we do when we are eating a spice bag. That was brought a, a tear to my eye. Now, what is the title you have given your song and why? Um, we, have, we have named our song Spice Up Your Life. We can all relate to this title. I mean, the, merits, the lyrics work as a metaphor. We are not just speaking about the physical spice of a spice bag, but the f- fulfilment of living your life to the fullest and enjoying each and every spice. <laughs> what is the name of your group and why? Uh, the Absolute Wizards, as we felt it was an original name and a unique and a, we are a unique and original artist. Wizard implies a magical and mysterious nature in which we feel applies to each of our personalities. Thank you. And final question. What made you enjoy your song school experience? Kevin and Joey influenced our love for this activity greatly. Two wise men beyond their years. <laughs> two, t- two legends, to say the least. We could not have been able to enjoy and make the most of this experience without them. Great uh, crack banter and knowledge was exchanged over the course of these two days. <laughs> whoop, whoop. Well, thank you, Absolute Wizard. That was just, just beautiful. And now we're going to hear their song, Spice Up Your Life. <laughs> Just came home The only thing I would like right now Is something cheeky Something nice Something with a beer voice Spice up your life this 
legendary wizards and I'd like to thank everyone especially Joe and Kevin today for Woo! doing song school with us Woo! and yeah! 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 Oh, you're fan you're fan oh, you're just 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 angry very much just like <laughs> we're gonna leave you on to our next group thanks guys it was a great experience Welcome back to the podcast. Uh, we're here with 4T and we've written and recorded three original songs over the last two days. Now let's meet the first group. Dream Team with a J for Joey. Who's in your group? Elizabeth. Orla. Kate. Sarah. Dieran. Kate. Kleena. <laughs> um, what is the name of your song? Um, going out. <laughs> Saturday night. Saturday night. <laughs> um, what's the inspiration for your song? Uh, the inspiration behind our song is uh, based on the division between the north and south side. Uh, we express this through the comparison between north and south side girls getting ready for a night out. We believe this song promotes unity between both sides as they come together at the disco through their shared love for music and we're very passionate about portraying this message. Did you find this hard or easy? Um, we found it quite challenging to think of lyrics that flowed well. However, the whole experience was very enjoyable and rewarding. <laughs> Okay, thank you. Now let's listen to your song, Saturday Night. <laughs> Thank you. 
good looking. Thank you, what a wonderful song. On to our next group. <laughs> Emily. Rebecca. Caroline. Lucy. Leah. Our song is called The Tourist. Um, what's the inspiration for your song? Well, you know, we just really wanted to promote the tourism in Ireland today. As it's Paddy's Day coming up, we just noticed that a lot of tourists are gathering around the spire in Paddy's day, on Paddy's Day. So we just wanted to promote tourism and just look into all the tourists and their accents and stuff uh what's something you learned by doing the song <laughs> we learned that um every person has their own different perception of dublin some people like it some people may tend to get lost others might not have a clue of what's going on <laughs> <laughs> and they pennies is a really hard place to find especially if you're by the spire <laughs> yeah um, what was the hardest part about song school? I think it was like the tempo and just kind of getting the music right and fitting all the words into the music and just making the song flow and sound proper. Yeah. Okay, now time to listen to your song. <laughs> How you doing? My is the name. Clearly lost in Dublin. Why are all the streets the same? Trying to find pennies for the last half hour. Somehow I've ended up at the silly spire. Howdy. My name is Mary Lou. I'm a southern belt and I don't know what to do. I'm lost here in Ireland. This place is very strange. Wish I could be back. Home on the range. <laughs> Right, my name is Cheryl, Newcastle at Ain't Faw. Tonight it will be wicked while we're out in Temple Bar. Out with me mates, we're just having a laugh, praying to God that they don't wreck the gaff. <laughs> Claire ici, by any chance, show me to the leafy. MLA say they sell barrettes, but really, I wouldn't be that too right yet. Dublin is a so schöne nice Stadt. Alles ist cool, and zwar nicht wie bei uns, sondern in einem grünen Grün als wäre es Kunst. Eins, woran man sich jedoch gewöhnen muss, ist die Freundlichkeit hier. Überall ein Thank you und ein Sorry hier. Yeah. 
Okay, so thank you for that great song. Now on to our last group, the BHCs. So who's in your group? Um, Anya. <laughs> Hannah. Emery. Jessica. Elaine. Um, what's the name of your song? Light of Brings You Home. <laughs> and what was the inspiration for your song? Um, like when you break up with your boyfriend or girlfriend. Oh. Like how hard it can be and that life will like life will get better if it feels like it's not gonna get better or get better. Okay, thank you. So did you find it hard or easy? Um, um, um it's sorta of difficult mm -hmm. to like like think of words that would go together and think of I don't know, a rhythm. Okay, thank you. So now let's listen to your song. Running through everything in my mind Thoughts and more thoughts in my head Hearing you say let's just be friends But I didn't want it to be the end tuning in to Song School Show live over the past two weeks in Loretto on the Green. If you enjoy the songs, you can find them at songschoolvlog.com. For more information, check us out at songschool.ie and Facebook and Twitter. Give, Give us a like! like.